Welcome to another video production by the Alberta Water Council. Today we will be talking about source water protection. Life depends on water. In Alberta, our quality of life is tied to healthy and sustainable water supplies for the environment, our communities and our economic well-being. Alberta has and will continue to face significant pressures on its water resources. More than 80% of the province's water supply is found in the north, while 20% is found in the south. On the other hand, 80% of water demand is in the south. Population growth, droughts and agricultural and industrial development are increasing demand and pressure on the province's water supplies, and the risks to the health and well-being of Albertans, our economy and our aquatic ecosystems. In the past, Alberta has been able to manage water supplies while maintaining a healthy aquatic environment as there was a relatively abundant clean supply to meet the needs of the communities and economy. However, fluctuating and unpredictable water supply in recent years has stressed the need to make major shifts in how we manage this finite resource. Although Alberta has a fairly good supply of water, variations in geography, climate and the hydrological cycle create regions and periods of water scarcity. Source water protection is a common approach that is taken to safeguard our drinking water supplies. The key to ensuring clean, safe and reliable drinking water is to understand the drinking water supply from the source all the way to the consumer's tap. The main steps in this important process involves protection of the source, water treatment, inspection, testing, distribution, and drinking water supply. This knowledge includes understanding the general characteristics of the water and the land surrounding the source, as well as mapping all the real and potential threats to the water quality. These threats can be natural, such as seasonal droughts or flooding, or created by human activity such as agriculture, industrial practices, or recreational activities in the watershed. Threats can also arise in the treatment plant or distribution system due to operational breakdowns or aging infrastructure. Source water protection is a multi-barrier approach that takes all of these threats into account and makes sure that there are barriers in place to either eliminate them or minimize their impact. It includes selecting the best available source, example, lake, river, aquifer, and protecting it from contamination, using effective water treatment and preventing water quality deterioration in the distribution system. The approach recognizes that while each individual barrier may not be able to completely remove or prevent contamination and therefore protect public health, Together, barriers work to provide greater assurance that the water will be safe to drink in the long term. In Alberta, several sources of water are used for drinking water purposes. Water in rivers, lakes, and wetlands are known as surface water. Groundwater is found beneath the Earth's surface in gaps and pore spaces between material that may be loose such as sand and gravel or hardened like sandstone and conglomerate. These underground water bearing materials are called aquifers and recharge when water from the surface percolates into the ground. The majority of Alberta's drinking water comes from surface water sources while smaller volumes are withdrawn from groundwater sources. In our province, source water protection for drinking water supplies is occurring in various geographical areas using several approaches and spearheaded by diverse players. Sources of drinking water are protected through a suite of existing land and water management approaches that are designed to ensure acceptable water quality and quantity conditions for a diverse range of uses. Through the cumulative effects management approach, several frameworks and plans collectively strive to safeguard drinking water sources. These include the Land Use Framework under the Alberta Land Stewardship Act, Regional Plans and Water Quality Management Frameworks. A multitude of regulations and standards work to protect drinking water supplies. Some include Environmental and Protection Enhancement Act, Water Act, Public Health Act, source water protection plans, drinking water safety plans, and approvals, as well as environmental performance plans. 
the province's Water for Life strategy and its associated partnerships of the Alberta Water Council, Watershed Planning and Advisory Councils, and Watershed Stewardship Groups provide policy advice, watershed management plans, and stewardship work to manage water sources. Source water protection is achieved through watershed management planning and the combined efforts and commitment of a wide range of participants including, but not limited to, federal, provincial and municipal governments, watershed groups, stakeholders and the public. The Waterworks utility is also an active participant in this process. The Government of Alberta, along with a number of municipalities, watershed planning and advisory councils and other groups have developed source water protection plans and other documents that have a watershed focus. The creation of these plans have been on the increase over the past few years. Achieving effective source water protection is a complex task that requires careful consideration of many different water uses. One of the greatest challenges to successful source water protection is its integration with other land and water management strategies. Viewing source water protection as a component of integrated watershed management has been one way to address this challenge. Our province's growing population and economy will continue to increase the demand for water, while a changing climate has sparked the need to adapt and plan for the future. Thank you for viewing this video today. The Alberta Water Council is currently working on a source water protection initiative. If you have questions or would like more information about this work, please contact our staff.